guys ready to order? Since we come in every Tuesday night at 6 o'clock and order the same exact thing, and it's now 6.08, I believe your question not only answers itself, but also stands alongside such other nonsensical queries as who let the dogs out and uh, how are they hanging? <laughs> Okay, so the usual with extra spit on Sheldon's hamburger. Penny, a moment. Do you have plans this weekend? Oh, gee, Amy, I'm sorry. I'm actually pretty busy this weekend. I'll be serving food that was ordered today. <laughs> That's too bad. I was hoping you could be my plus one at the Institute of Interdisciplinary Studies Symposium on the impact of current scientific research on societal interactions. <laughs> the what? It's an annual science conference. We've all been invited to speak. Oh, okay, well, you know, like I said, I have plans, so. Shame. Since you're my best friend, I thought it would be a good bonding opportunity. I'm your best friend? Don't you read my blog? <laughs> oh, don't feel bad. I never read Leonard's and I used to sleep with him. <laughs> Do you know anybody else who would appreciate an all-expense-paid spa weekend at a four-star resort in Big Sur? No, I, I'm sorry, free what? Sorry, what, what? <laughs> I think her weekend just opened up. Wait, wait, just to be clear, when you guys say spa, does that mean the same thing as when regular people say it? Pretty much. Except we keep our shirts on in the sauna. You know, it is going to be difficult, but I'm going to cancel my plans so I can do this for my bestie. Please don't touch my breasts. I, I wasn't going to. All right, I just want to establish boundaries. This is great. I haven't had a vacation in ages. In order to take a vacation, one first has to work. You know, for a smart guy, you really seem to have a hard time grasping the concept don't piss off the people who handle the things you eat. That does seem to be a valid principle. I trust Penny will adhere to the official California restaurant worker's solemn oath of ethics and cleanliness. I don't believe there's any such thing. You lied to me?